show you the uh, electrical panel or what do they call the e-panel uh, I actually got it from midnight midnight solar and it's got the uh, it's all set up inside the wiring is all inside here which I'll show you here in just a minute I wanted to show you here's the Outback uh, 48 volt inverter and then I have the Flexmax 80 charge controller and this box here right here fits everything in there here's the breakers over here over here for the charge controller and here's the main breaker over there uh, 175 volt breaker for the uh, inverter and these for, for if you're going to use for generator or anything like that but right now I'm not going to worry about this this is just the main thing right here this is the main inverter shutoff switch and these are the 80 amp oh I'm sorry um, what are they yeah they're 80 uh, 80 amp breakers so this is for in coming in to the charge controller and coming out of the charge control controller all right and let's see well let me show you actually this is for the PV actually for the PV array and for battery all right so basically in and out so let me show you inside of the uh, box here let me give you a bird's eye view of it if I can here yeah, sitting on my table and there it is inverter charge controller so this is the second part of the video it shows you the first part of the video with the uh, array and the combiner box now I'm going to be taking the, uh, the wiring out of the combiner box and putting it into here. So let me show you inside of here in just a minute. And here's a picture of it again. Actually, before I do that, I want to show you inside of here. Inside of the charge controller, how the wiring is. So this part right here is for the, uh, it gives you the temperature of the battery keeps the temperature of the battery um, this one here the red is the red is my um, the wire the wiring coming in from the uh, uh, from uh, drawing a blank here coming in from from the panels so your PV array here's your ground here's ground again but all you need is one and here is your uh, positive coming in from your battery so here's your positive from your PV array positive for your battery all you need is one ground for here for the both of them or you could do a if you want you can put another like a little jumper from here to here if you want but all you need is the one and then here's your your ground so positive negative negative positive all right so this is positive battery negative battery negative PV array, positive, positive uh, PV array. Okay, you're basically what I'm saying. That's just your solar panels. And then here's your ground. All right. So that's that. And then let me show you here, up here. Uh, you really can't see inside there, but what we have here is inside. You can kind of see it. We have. I'm not going to take that off. We have the hot out. Then we have the AC neutral, which is the green. Then we have AC, actually AC hot is going to be the white. AC neutral is the green. And then we have our AC hot out. Actually, let me take a look here. Let's see if we can do this real quick. And yeah, okay, so here we go. So we got our, right here we got our AC neutral. Right here's our AC neutral out. Then we have our chassis ground, which is the green. And then we have our AC neutral in, which is the white. 
and then our last one down here is our AC neutral hold on the AC neutral AC neutral in and then we have our AC hot in okay AC neutral in then our hot AC neutral hot in all right kind of confusing but if you read the schematic you'll see and then inside the box is where I will tie into inside here I where I'll tie into the uh, in uh, the uh, inverter not the inverter but the uh, the switch my uh, yeah, so everything's pre-wired from here and then into the box will go from out of here with so I can go into the transfer switch so binder box from the last video so I'm going to show you inside of it and then uh, the wiring that's going out of what's coming from out of here into my garage and then where I'm going to hook up the um, e-panel electrical panel so hold on the electrical panel with the um, inverter and charge controller on it so hold on let me show you okay so here we are like you saw last time in the last video here's the array all the array stuff and here's what's going into the e-panel so we got we got the uh, power going up into here like I showed you last time and we got our ground coming out of here going into ground right here and then we have our ground or not our or not our you know we have our ground here and then we have our sorry we have our hot hot and then ground from the from the uh, what's gonna go into the box the power box so all three of these the green the power and the black ground which is right here is going coming out of here and down into here into the garage coming out of here power the um, equipment ground and the the uh, ground for the uh, the ground from the array okay so and this is the ground for all the equipment for everything we'll ground all of it the um, e box itself the charge controller and the um, inverter okay all right you guys so let me show you inside inside the e-panel I'm gonna mount this thing up inside of the e-panel all right so all the wiring coming in coming here out of the charge controller and the wiring going up coming out of the inverter okay these are where I'm gonna hook in the inverter rack the AC hot in the neutral which will be the green and then the black which is the AC hot out okay so then I can go into my transfer switch coming out of here drop it out of here out of my transfer and send it over to my transfer switch the wire the uh, the uh, battery wires will come up through here come up through here and then just hook into here positive here negative all right and then my wiring what came was coming from the garage is the green neutral the green for all the all the equipment see the ground right here will go here and then the black all ground here and the red I will come from up out of here the power and that's gonna light it all up all right you guys that e-panel is from midnight solar and it's really nice uh, pre-wired and you just got to get the wire and uh, except this type of wire the six gauge what is that six gauge is that four or eight I'm not sure what that is that's not six gauge that's outside in the in the uh, converter box um, anyway so you gotta just get your wire and for to wire your inverter and your charge controller the rest of the wiring comes with it like this and all your shunts comes with it alright 
and also these come with it and you got to buy these separate I just got 80 amps for in and out because I have an 80 amp uh, charge controller all right you guys until next time uh, give me a thumbs up uh, subscribe and got any questions just leave them got any thoughts or anything else that you think I forgot or something I did wrong let me know all right you guys you have a great day and until next time